Hello students today we are going to learn about networking devices networking devices are the devices which are used to connect computers or other electronic devices together in order to share files or resources like printers or fax machines so first networking device which we are going to talk about is modem modem stands for modulator demodulator modulator means it converts digital signal into analog signals demodulation means it converts analog signals into digital signals as it can convert analog signal into digital signals and vice versa so it enables us to connect our computer to the available internet connection over the existing telephone lines telephone lines carry analog signals computer technology is largely digital so we need modems as translators if i want to send a file from my computer to other device using telephone lines so the file will be sent by computer in digital form to enable the transmission of file via phone line it should be converted into analog form this work will be done by modem at the destination receiving modem further converts analog into digital signals so the data can be understood at the receiving end there are two types of modem first one is external and the other one is internal external modems are externally connected usually through the lan ports or usb port of computer internal modems comes as a separate part that is installed on the motherboard now i am going to explain working of modem in simple language using this diagram which you can see on the screen computer at the bottom of the diagram is client machine which will be used by users like us two computers at the top of the diagram are the servers which will provide internet service to the client machine both are connected through telephone lines if client machine wants to make any request to the server client machine will produce digital signals as we all know computer produces and understands digital signals only ab computer digital signal send karega बट टेलीफोन लाइन कैन नॉट कैरी डिजिटल सिग्नल्स तो हमें ऐसा डिवाइस चाहिए जो डिजिटल को एनालॉग में कन्वर्ट करे जिससे कि टेलीफोन लाइन उसे ट्रांसमिट कर सके सो वी नीड अ मॉडर्म फॉर दैट वेन द डेटा इन एनालॉग फॉर्म विल रीच एट सर्वर एंड थ्रू टेलीफोन लाइन नाउ इट नीड्स टू बी कन्वर्टेड इन टू डिजिटल सिग्नल्स सो वी विल यूज अ मॉडर्म एट रिसीवर एंड ऑल्सो Next networking device we are going to learn about is hub. It is used to connect multiple computers and computing devices directly to network by using cables. Each connection is called port. Hubs cannot filter data means they cannot check the address of receiver port so data packet are sent to all connected devices. Next networking device is switch. It contains many ports to connect different network segments. Network segments means local area network metropolitan area network it is similar to hub but has higher efficiency and performance than hub the switch can perform error checking before forwarding data that makes it very efficient so switch can perform error checking to so, switch data send karne se pehle ye bhi dekh leta hai ki jo data hai wo error free hai so it makes it very efficient as it does not forward data that packets have errors and forwards good data packets selectively to correct port only and this is also a advantage of using switch that it sends the data packet to the intended port switch is aware of the addresses assigned to each ports and sends the incoming data only to the intended port next device is repeater it is also networking device its job is to regenerate signals over the same network before the signals becomes too weak or corrupted when transmitted over long distances so what is the functioning of repeater the repeater you can see from its name also it repeats the signal okay to jab hum kisi long distance pe signal ko send karte hain it can become weak or corrupted like when we are talking and we are standing at long distance you might have seen ki hamari voice quality interrupt ho jati hai to hum hamari sound utni clear nahi aati hai jitna hum pass mein khade hoke sunenge the same thing happens with signals also when they are transmitted over long distances signal same quality ke receiver end pe pahunche for that we use repeater it regenerates the signal wo signal ko dobara same strength ka produce karte hai next is router router is a device like a switch that routes data packets based on their ip addresses router normally connect lans and wans together it controls network perf it controls network traffic by choosing best route for data packets to be transmitted at receiver's end so router works as a traffic police traffic police kya karti hai when there is a lot of traffic on the road traffic police ka work kya hota hai it tells the best route to the vehicle drivers ki aap is route se jaiye and it divides the traffic into different routes whichever is best route for the particular vehicle 
So similarly, router also tells the best route to the data which is transmitting over the network. So what happens with this? Network traffic gets divided between different routes. Next networking device is Gateway. A gateway, as the name suggests, it acts as an entrance to another network. It allows us to carry out various online activities. It is a shared connection between local area network and wide area network. It works as a messenger agent that takes data from one system, interprets it and transfers it to another. the system gateway is also called a packet converter last networking device is bridge it is a repeater with add on functionality of filtering content by reading addresses of source and destination it interconnects two local area networks working on same protocol it reduces congestion because it filters the data by reading address of source and destination thank you for watching the video